Okay, so this is the wooden mirror. It's, um, it's a large display. It's made out of um, 835 of these uh, wooden tiles. Um, and optically, the way uh, you get the image is uh, when the uh, little tiles tilt downwards, they get to be dark. And when they tilt upwards, they hit the light, like this one here, and they get to be bright. These are all motorized, so they can move up and down, controlled by the computer, like so. And uh, on top of the uh, piece, on the uh, ceiling, are spotlights aimed down at a steep angle. That's how we get a good contrast on the display. The servo motors that are actually moving these wooden pixels can position them from very down, uh, probably 30 degrees pointing down, to about 30 degrees pointing upwards. In the center of the piece, more or less at uh, eyesight of a typical uh, average person is a tiny camera. It's hiding here between four of the wooden chips. And that video camera is capturing the image of whoever or whatever stands in front. And that video signal is then sent to a computer and that image is then evaluated in grayscale, in black and white values, uh, where each black and white value uh, actually corresponds to an angle of uh, one of these wooden pixels. A video signal uh, usually contains like 500,000 uh, pixels, a lot of pixels, and my system only uses 835 of those. And that is done by the digitizer on the computer. The system is quite fast, so it refreshes itself probably 15 or 20 times a second, so it yields sort of a smooth animation.